welcome back to my channel. My name is Maisie Martin. If you're new to my channel, subscribe down below and turn the post notification bell to be notified every single time I upload a brand new video. So today I'm going to be filming my everyday skincare routine and makeup routine. So if this is confusing you a little bit, basically I will be showing you my skincare routine that I do on an everyday basis and my makeup routine that I do on an everyday basis. If that makes sense. So that's what I'm going to be doing today. If you enjoyed this video, give it a huge thumbs up and make sure you do subscribe to see a new video every single Sunday at 10am because I would love it if you did subscribe. I'm also doing Vlogmas on my vlogging channel, More Maisie. You should definitely go subscribe. Vlogmas is basically where I upload every single day throughout December till the 25th. So you should really, you should go, really go subscribe because it's really cool and I love doing it and I get to see all my everyday life. So go Subscribe to my second channel to see Vlogmas and I feel like I've rambled on way too much So let's get on with the video. So basically the concept of this video is I'll be showing you the products that I use For my makeup routine and skincare routine But I'm gonna show you my skincare routine first, but then I'm gonna show you how I do it and things This video is not sponsored whatsoever. So if you think it is I promise it's not these are just products that I use every single day and I love so, for my skincare routine, I'm obviously in the shower and I do it in the shower at night because I go in the shower at night and then in the morning I just wash my face before I go to school and then do my skincare routine. So, at night when I'm in the shower, I will just put shampoo on my hair and then I'll get my face wet and I first put on... Oh, it's got some water in it. Just a little bit. The Lacura Smoothing Face Scrub. This is basically the Lacura Fit Smoothing Face Scrub. It's just a got really fine little milled, milled, little fine scrub parts. I don't know what it is, but this is it. It's a really really good product. I really really enjoy it because it just exfoliates my skin a little bit and just gets all the dry skin off before I use my other product. This is just amazing. I put this on, just rub it on my face and leave it on for about ten seconds and then I rinse it off because then it's just perfect and it's really really good. I'm not sure how much this is, but I'll leave my skincare routine product my skincare products down below so you can go buy them and stuff but yeah i've got that i then once i've done that i will then do my second part of my skincare routine which i bought this yesterday no it wasn't yesterday it was a few days ago and i've started using it ever since and i absolutely love it it is the garnier skin active micellar cleansing gel wash if you've ever tried the micellar 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 i don't know i call it micellar if you've ever used a micellar cleansing water which is a water form of this you basically use a cotton pad for it and just rub it on your skin it takes your makeup off but i use it to take my makeup off and just to skincare my skin because it's just really good it washes my face so basically this is what it looks like it's just got a pump and i just pump two pumps on and i just rub it all over my skin nice and soft and it keeps it all nice and soft afterwards and i love it so much I remember how much it's like because I only got it a few days ago, but I've had the look of a face scrub for ages. But I think this was £2.65, which is really... Ah, that scared me so much! <laughs> Don't do that! <laughs> that is horrible. I hate that. Anyway, I this was like £2.65, and I really, really like it. I also leave this one on for 10 seconds, and then I just rinse it off nicely, which I absolutely love this. It's really, really good for the price of it, and I've already used that much of it because I use about two pumps, and it just, it washes your face, but it leaves it so soft and nice. I love it so much. It's absolutely amazing. I will then, I don't have the pot of it right now because it's in my bathroom, but I then just, when I come out of the shower, I will then use coconut oil just to rub on me, like on my skin, which just leaves it all soft and nice. But if I'm not doing this in the shower like I am showing you in these little clips, I will literally just rinse my face and then put them all on. So that's what I do for my skincare routine. It's really, really good. It just leaves my skin really nice because I have a few pimples on my cheeks, which you can't really see, but you can feel them. And it's really nice when I do my skincare routine because it just smooths it. <laughs> smooth it. It just smooths my skin down and it's just really, really good. I really, really enjoy them products. So first of all, I will put my hair up into just anything really, either bun, ponytail, or I'll use, sometimes use a headband. So I then go in with my Lacura face scrub and I just wait for the tap to warm up because I like warm water, not cold water, because like I feel like everybody uses warm water. And then I just get my face wet and then I squirt some of my face scrub onto my hand i love this stuff it's really really good exfoliating your skin if you've got really dry skin if you've got oily skin i wouldn't recommend it but i just 
like rub that nicely into my skin and it just it's amazing this video is not sponsored i actually just love this product so much i leave it on for about 10 seconds just to wait for it to like sink in and just still exfoliate and then i'll just rinse it off with the water that i was waiting for then I will then go in with my Garnier Skin Active Micellar Cleansing Gel Wash, which is also amazing. This doesn't exfoliate or anything. It's just like a gel texture, and it's like the Micellar Cleansing Water. It takes your makeup off, and it cleans your face so well, and it's really good if you've got, like, small little pimples, or even if you just want to take your makeup off with it. It's amazing. I then wait 10 seconds again, and then rinse it off with the water, and you can see the steam coming out of the sink because it's absolutely boiling water because I like it being boiling so once that is all rinsed off which takes me a while to rinse it off because then I don't want it to get in my eyes I will then just pat my face dry with my towel and then I'm all done so now that my skin is all soft and nice I now do my makeup so I don't put too much makeup on throughout the day I literally just put like the tiniest bits on but I'm going to show you what I use. So all my makeup is in my If In Doubt Pout makeup bag. Which just looks like this inside here. My glasses are inside here. I don't know why. Um, oh, don't put them in the wet. So I don't use all of this makeup in here. I just use a few of it. So I'm just going to start off with just showing my products. So for my makeup, I start off by using my Revolution Focus and Fix Liquid Concealer. And I just put that underneath my eyes, round my nose, on my chin and my forehead and cheeks. It's an alright concealer. It doesn't have really good coverage. I am hoping for the Rimmel Wake Me Up concealer for Christmas. I then blend it in with my Studio London little sponge, which is really good. And once I've blended that in with most like with the sponge i will then go in with my studio london like fake artiste brush because the sponge sometimes blends it in but not all the time it's just good to go in over a brush because i just think it's better i will then use my rimmel stay matte in one transparent and use my real techniques powder brush to do that just to set my face so it's not like sticky and stuff because i don't like sticky faces I then go with my Barry M Flawless Chisel Cheeks Contour Kit and just bronze up with my Real Techniques Blush Brush and just on my cheeks, forehead, nose, chin and nose just so then it just bronzes me up and ready for the day. That's the middle shade I use. And then I go back in with my fake Artiste Brush and use the contour shade just to contour my cheekbones, jawline and forehead just because I like to contour but not harshly. I just like to do it so it adds more depth and shape into my face because I just like having depth and shape into my face that's the end shade that i use and then i will just blend that all out with the powder brush again from real techniques i then go in with my tarte amazonian clay miniature blush in the shade party and i just pop that on the apples of my cheeks and it's always so hard to open and again i use my real techniques blush brush because i need a bronzer bl brush really really bad I then go in with my collection Gorgeous Glow Bronzing Block in two and I use the top shade and this little small eyeshadow brush which is off eBay and I just put that on the cheeks, nose, mouth and eyebrow, well like my brow bone and then I will go in and curl my eyelashes, I just curl them for about 30 seconds on each eye and then I'll go in with mascara which I use my Revlon volume and length magnified mascara which i absolutely love i use this all the time it's my absolute favorite mascara ever and all these products i use for my makeup i love so much and then i'm done you enjoyed that different type of video i really liked filming that because it actually got me ready for the day which is it's always a good thing and i kind of liked the concept of that video i liked it how i talked you through it and then showed you how i did it so yes i will show you all the products i use for my makeup and for my skincare down below in the description box also comment some videos you'd like to see or in the poll up there because i would really really like you to decide for me because i'm struggling with some videos but i thought i'd just film this today and if you enjoyed it give it a huge thumbs up and i will see you next sunday well actually if you follow if you subscribe to my second channel then you'll see me every single day but if you just subscribe to this one which you should be subscribed to my vlog channel if you're not already i'll leave it linked down below as well but I'll see you next Sunday at 10am with a brand new video. Bye guys.